spring greetings, everybody. Aren't we so lucky to have this wonderful area along the American River Parkway to go for a walk and relieve some stress and take in the natural world? It's one of my favorite things about this area. And one question that we are receiving um, very often at this time is, can I take my dog on the trails here? Um, and if you haven't been here before, you probably don't know how special this place is. Um, here we have a designated watchable wildlife area, and it's actually a designated nature study area as well. And that means it's one parcel set aside from the rest of the parkway that is protected for our flora and fauna here, and protected for our wildlife, like the red-shouldered hawk behind me. And what you may not realize is a dog's presence on the trails does impose an impact on wildlife. Um, they survive by their senses and they don't know that your dog is a sweet and wonderful dog that would never hurt um, a flea or a fly, uh, but that it is a danger, predator. Predator is present, present and I must um, do everything I can to survive. And so they will leave the area, um, they will stop doing their natural habits of foraging food and they are experiencing stress. And as we know, stress can impact our health. And I know that our visitors here do not want to stress out our animals. So we thank you so much for keeping your dogs on leash. Um, you can take them anywhere in the parkway, just not here in the protected nature study area. So please do it, not just because it's a regulation, but do it because you wanna help us protect this habitat and keep it special. And um, do please come when you don't have your dog with you so you can see why this place is so special and a wonderful resource for us here in the Sacramento area. And thank you so much for all your support and see you out there on the trails.